welcome to our video of the ZMR 750A made by CMARC. This is a nitrogen capable machine that runs on compressed, compressed air or nitrogen. We're going to do a removal of a chip from this computer board. We have it in place. You can either hold the boards by the, uh, the uh, jaws here or on odd shaped boards, we can hold them by the edge of the board or by the tuning holes. There we go. Put that in there tightly. So what we're going to do is this is a removal profile. So we're going to go to our screen here and click on disassembly for removal. We've already set up our heat profile. So the rigid system comes out. We can line our component, which is in gold, into the nozzle, which is in blue. You can see our pickup tube here in the center is over the die. We fine tune our adjustment here. Looks good. We can adjust our line. We want to make our pickup tube a little bit bigger so we can see it there. Okay, so we're centered into the nozzle. We want to look at our profile, we can go over here and we can look at the heat perimeters. This is our profile. We're using a five stage profile with the peak reflow heat of 280C, a ramp of one degree per second. We're ready to start, so we'll put location confirmation. We can turn on our External lights. Now this is a computer controlled machine versus a touch screen with PLC. So with the computer controlled machine, it'll save all the profiles that we run. And you can do more in-depth profile analytics with this type of machine that uses a industrial computer. Right, I'm going to watch on the screen here. It tells us what I'm doing. We have our upper heater temperature, our lower heater temperature, our infrared, and we're just using one external thermal couple to monitor down by the chip here. And you can use up to seven thermal couple inputs on this machine. So we're going to let this profile run through. When the profile is done, I'm ready to remove the chip. We'll come back and show you how the chip is removed. Okay, so we're approaching near the end of the profile. See our profile here around 280. It's going to hold it for 30 seconds. Our external, couple, external thermal couple is at uh, 235. Let's remove our chip. Let's going to place it into the upper nest. After the cooling cycle, we're going to place the chip in the upper nest. Now it's waiting for us to confirm that we took the BGA out of the upper nest. There we go. We'll click BGA. Remove this confirmed here and then it'll go back to your home position. And that's our demo for VJ removal on the ZMR 7850A nitrogen capable VGA rework station by SEMA.